McCarthy Dixon defines a mother as the anchor who keeps the ship steady. Her ship, a small Fort Lauderdale bungalow, her crew, the children no one else wants. A 71-year-old widow with two grown children, Dorothy Dixon has been mother to more than 1,400 foster children in the last 32 years. I've had children come in my home that have been sexually abused, batted around. I've had children come in here that needed therapy. I've had all kinds of children in my life. Now there's Charlene, who's lived here 10 years after being abandoned as a seven-year-old. Adam, who arrived in June with serious adjustment problems. Gloria, who could manage only animal noises when she arrived here 12 years ago. And Ricky, placed by the state when he was eight. Kids that parents have tried to uh, control for years and years and years, and they even gotten to the point to ask the state to take them over, she can turn them around in, uh, in weeks. I feel everybody has a place in this life. And I don't believe any kid is born bad. Dorothy prods and scolds with a gentle tongue. The tools of her trade are encouragement and love. She takes you for what you are. She don't try to make you something you're not. I've grown very, very close to her. You know, I have a lot of respect for Mom Dixon. A Mother's Day tradition is taking the family photograph, one of the many families Dorothy has created, not only for the children but for herself, because she too was an orphan. Nobody wanted me when I was little. And I know what that's like. So it's, it's not a nice feeling. For Dorothy Dixon, Mother's Day is only a small reminder that knowing she is needed is the best part of being a mother. They give me so much. They give me life. Chris Bury, ABC News, Fort Lauderdale.